Flane. I hope you will allow me to apologize. Why would you need to do that? Last time, when I was working on my armor, you could have been gravely injured. You have been avoiding me ever since, so I want to reiterate how very sorry I am. I'm not sure that's entirely the case. So, you are not avoiding me? To be perfectly honest, I felt a bit embarrassed. When you embraced me before, it really caught me off guard. You're surprisingly strong for how slender you appear. Anyway, it all got me rather flustered. Oh, I see. Well, I do train quite often. On the battlefield, it is perfectly common to lift up a wounded comrade. It has nothing to do with your gender. In the heat of the moment, I pay no attention to such things. That is, uh, how I would explain it. I see. So you have a well of strength for embracing people, it seems. Well, I would not put it like that. Usually, when I embrace people, it is in the context of battle. Is that so? <laughs> uh, so the embrace was nothing more than a rescue. Perhaps I was flustered needlessly. I wonder... if you would consider embracing me when my life is not in peril. Huh? Why? Because I'd like to feel that way again. That's why. How about it? Or is your capacity for embracing limited exclusively to warfare? <laughs> uh, oh, I see what is going on here. I had forgotten how charmingly ethereal you can be. Very well. As per your request, I shall embrace you again. Uh, I'm delighted. Does right now work for you? Why, of course. Easily done. Although, perhaps we shouldn't tell Sedith. Agreed. Better to let this be our little secret. 